I recently received this uh, refurbished Galaxy Note 10 Plus 5G and I want to set it up for notifications for uh, apps using the sounds that I used on a previous phone. Um, these are not the default sounds so I want to add my own personal uh, notification sounds. Now to do that we need to go into settings so select settings and then we scroll down to apps scroll down to the app we want to do and I want to pick Gmail for instance uh, notifications and uh, we need to have show notifications that are on and email we're going to click that so what we have here is we have uh, a number of settings if you have it on silent obviously it's no good so you need the alert on um, and then select sound now by default um, there are no custom sounds available in the phone so you can pick one of the default ones from the galaxy so alien alpha cassiopeia but i find these are not distinctive enough so i need my own notification but there's nowhere in here for you to select a folder to go and find a file that may already be on your phone so what we need to do is we need to load the file into a specific folder on the phone so next part of the video we need to go uh, and connect the phone to the computer to get the file the audio file whichever format you're going to use into the correct folder on the phone the easiest way to do it is as follows connect the phone to a PC and it should open up the Explorer uh, go to the phone and you're looking for a folder called notifications and currently we can see this is empty so what we need to do is we need to put our audio file into this directory uh, it just so happens I have a file here so we're just going to copy that go back to the phone go back to notifications folder paste that there and then that will appear as a usable file when we go back to the app okay we're now back at the phone so go back to settings apps gmail notifications email and if we go back into sound we still have the, the one we chose before but now we have a new section that's called custom and you can now see that this is the file name yeah that's right uh, you can now see a file name uh, for the mp3 that I added before and it's as simple as that 